Hello guys and welcome to a news recap of everything that happened yesterday. This is coming out late because I just had to do a lot of stuff. So I'm sorry for that. But let's just get into it. So I'm just gonna be getting stuff from the site because the site had so much more information than the direct it told pretty much. So the site actually has that there was a Rotom phone that would act like a Pokédex. And you can attach it to your bicycle to make it go faster and go across water. So I'm guessing there's not going to be any um, Poké Pedro, like Sun and Moon, which is fine in my opinion. Um, it was pretty cool how Pokemon killed you, but I think this is more quote unquote natural, but it's Pokemon, it doesn't need to be natural. But I guess um, you might be able to fly with your bike for a fly replacement if they're going Rotom flying, but yeah, that's obviously going to happen, right? Um, another thing that um, they revealed in the Direct is all like the people, or well, not all the people, but some of the people. Um, you have Leon, which is the Galar champion. You have Hop, which is your rival, or one of your rivals, which might mean more rivals. And he is the younger brother. He's the younger brother of Leon. You have Professor Magnolia, uh, which is the professor of the Galar region, obviously. And she researches the Dynamax phenomenon. And then you have Sonia, which is Magnolia's assistant, and she will give you advice on your journey. Um, Talking about Dynamats, um, it only allows you to, like, Dynamats, only allowed in, like, certain locations, and it requires you to have the um, Dynamats ban, and it will only last um, three turns, and you can, you can only do it once per battle, and it might give stat boosts, from what I can tell. Um, so, yeah, that's all. Um, once you get Dynamats, you get Mats moves, it's pretty much like Z moves. Um, it might not have, like, a base power increase. I couldn't find anything about that. But it will add second like abilities or statuses like the normal type move called Mass Strike will reduce the speed of the Pokemon it hits. Um, there are it's also something that's really like interesting, Match Raid Battles. It's a new battle format and you can team up with three other people to, wild, to battle Wild Dynamats Pokemon and you can catch it if you defeat it. The Wild Mon will remain Dynamats. Um, through the entire battle, so the wild mon, not your mon, and because um, you have three other people, you only can dynamax one of your mons, and that's for like the entire group. So be smart. But um, like if it's sunny outside, you can get a steeny. While it's raining outside, you can get a lantern. Um, it has local and online, and if you're by yourself, there will be support trainers will be added in. I don't know how that's gonna work, and if you are able to control those trainers. Because if those people dynamax their own mons, that's not really cool. But, yeah. And the site says something about a foursome. I'm just going to leave that there. I found that hilarious. Um, there are gym leaders, so that leak from Nintendo, quote unquote, leak. That's a gym masters. Either they changed it or gym leaders is just the, always the time Nintendo messed up. Um, they can use dynamaxing, so I'm guessing this is one of the um, certain locations where you can dynamax your mon. And the first gym leader is, well, probably the first gym leader, we don't know yet, is Milo, and he has um, grass types. And he can dynamax his, um, I believe, Elder Grass? Elder Grass? I think so. Talking about Elder Grass, let's talk about the new Pokemon. There were seven new Pokemon revealed, five regulars and two legendaries. So, the first one, and my favorite, is Gossiflor. Um, it's a grass type, and has abilities called Cotton Down and Regenerator. Uh, Regenerator, we know about. It's actually kind of annoying. Hopefully this mon's not bulky, but... Cut down is when a Pokemon hit you, I'm guessing when the status moves, its speed stat will be lowered. So, I guess this is um, Mudsdale Stamina, I believe. Well, if you get hit by a move, your defense faces a physical move. So, um, it evolves into Elder Goss, which is obviously the evolution of Gossifal. It has the same type... And the abilities are the same, so it has Cotton Down and Regenerator. Then you have a fan favorite called Rulu. Rulu? Yeah, Rulu. Which is a normal type and has the abilities Fluffy and Run Away. And it's apparently extremely fluffy, so I'm guessing this is the fluffiest mon ever created. Um, unlike this mon, which is Corviknight. I think Corviknight. Um, I have a G instead of a C, but I think it's uh, C. It is Flying Steel. It has the abilities Pressure and Unnerve, and it's used by the Galar Taxi for transportation town to town. And it will probably not actually be a fly replacement since um, you can't fly to routes, and it's only 
and you only can do it in like a certain location. Um, I hope it's not fly uh, replacement. It sounds kind of annoying if it is. Another mod released was oh, revealed was Dreadnought, which is a water and rock type, and has the ability Strong Jaw and Shell Armor. And the legends got revealed, which is Jaxian and Zamazenta. Um, no abilities or types was revealed, but it probably will be Pot Steel if Game Freak has any logic, which the Sun Legendary was, well, not filed, so we don't know. And it probably has a new ability. Um, encounters, it looks like a mix between um, random and overboard encounters. Um, it also looks like there's less overboard encounters than Let's Go. Um, it also looks like only overworld encounters and wild areas, which I don't know if that's a fancy name for routes. Um, I hope not, but it looks like it. Also, that's the only way, the only, that's the only area where you can do raid battles, it seems. Um, maybe I'm getting this wrong, but if it's just routes, then it makes sense. Sword and Shield launches this November 15th, it got a release date, and a double pack will be available for purchase that includes both Pokemon Sword and Shield for 120 bucks. Um, it comes in a box and maybe with a code for like 100 potions. Um, what did you guys think of the Pokemon trick? I thought it was pretty, pretty good. Um, since the Legendaries got released, um, which copy will you be picking up? Or will you wait to see if there's any more version exclusive stuff? If you guys did enjoy this recap, because this is coming out really late, you can like, subscribe, I'll try to keep doing these. Um, and you can comment below what I asked above. Thank you, and goodbye.